Alright, ladies and gentlemen, how you doing? We got a little bit of pulsitos, starting in with Rio Beats and Quill, a.k.a. Night Quill, a.k.a. Uh, uh, I forgot his other secondary, but I think this is a tournament match, and if it is, Robbie with a hefty lead, my goodness. But Quill definitely not a slacker player, but I think he has been coming up from the Woodworks. He hasn't been playing for some time. Uh, I haven't seen him for a hot minute, but he started coming back to nap, so uh, I want to see how uh, Quill will be doing in pools and a bracket, hopefully. Gets the hard backs. Okay. Quill's taking his time towards the ledge. Meanwhile, Robbie taking more time, getting more pressure on the uh, edge guard, but Quill sneaks in the up smash. A little bit of drifty, boys. Oh, I'm actually surprised I actually hit, but I'm guessing Quill tried to go for a forward in that situation, allowing for a hitbox extension. And Rabi takes it game uno. I wonder if uh, Quill will be taking, to, uh, taking Rabi to a frustrating stage, maybe Dream Land or something, allowing for a high survivability. Yeah, going Dreams. We're the land of the Dream and the home of the Braves. All right, a lot of backers, neutral situation. This time Quill has the center stage, but it has a quick mix up right now, as I say it. Gets a follow up. Rabi's taking his time right now. Doesn't want to commit too hard in the neutral. Guess what turn is pulled out. Okay, tight. Freaking Roger Federer is US Open. Okay, Quill looks like he's he's respecting a little bit of the spacing for Robbie, but right there commits a little bit too hard with Robbie wave dashing in. Okay. Ooh, I wonder if that was an up tilt by Quill, but I guess he did not come out with that. Okay, back air. Quick turnaround. One thing that Peach has at her arsenal is the... That double jump float, it can trick up the uh, the movement, whereas other characters usually tend to uh, 
when you jump in a certain direction, it's very hard to shift momentum very quickly, and Peach can do that really easily. Gets the first stock. But opportunity for Quill to see if he can steal the stock and maybe not get too much percent against Peach. Oh, that was a roll, but I wonder if that was an aerial by Rabbit as well. Okay, a lot of spacing by Quill. Looks like he's tending to drift a little bit more away. He doesn't want to get any of the aerials out of shield by Ryab. He doesn't want to attack on any percent. Rod, uh, Tiger Woods coming out right now, but not to the fullest advantage. Tries to bait out maybe a, maybe a shield, grab, shield grab right there, but Ryab does not bite. Okay. Oh, no grab by the ledge by Quill. Oh, a little bit of tricks is right there. Once in a blue moon, you throw it out, and you got to be very wary of it. Usually a high percent or last stock situation or high pressure situations. That's when Peach sometimes will pull it out. Okay, grabs on the ledge, rising there, but doesn't get anything out of it. Gets the shield out. More spacing coming in. Oh, that was an air to shield by Rabbit, but he does not drift in time. Wispy was probably messing it up a little bit of the aerial mobility right there in that in that hit confirm that Rabbit could have taken. Gets that back air, edge guard situation. Quill should chase him down. Gets that back air turnarounds. Unless he's gonna Skype him out. No. Ooh, that tech though. Okay. Ryby still solidifying a longer lead for himself. Gets the grab. Quill immediately retreats towards center stage. Doesn't want any of the hits going in. It's low shield, but no shield poke on the L smash. Gets that Nair. Is that it? No, still living. Okay, winky face. Gets a soft hit. Quill with a second lease of life. Another winky face. Okay. Oh, a little deep in. Oh, I'm surprised that back air uh, missed, but I guess the up air of Rabbit kind of came out a little too early. Not allowing any hitbox extension. Will Quill get the hit confirmed? He baits out the roll and then punishes it accordingly. Now, this is a hefty lead for Rabbit, but all it takes. In, in all commentator world, we always say all it takes is one little opportunity. Ooh. Okay, I think that's it. Guess the stock there. Let's see if Quill's going to pull out an old. Oh, I wonder if that was a raw rest that Quill's trying to hard call for the jump, but doesn't get it. Guess the up throw. Tries to bait out a jump out of shield, but then Robbie tries to retaliate with the Tiger Woods, but doesn't get it. Z drops. Oh, questionable right there, but no punish significant by Quill. Gets the grab. Gets the back air. Rabbi a little too uh, eager with that recovery attack. Gets in there. All right. A little bit of a mix up on the hitbox right there. Ooh. Rabbi had the right idea, but Quill uh, air dodges. I wonder if that was also a wave land by the platform. Maybe missing it. Load of back airs. Ooh. Robby takes that gratis. The Quill. Okay. Quill answers back. 1%. Okay, air dodges out. Okay, wow. Another hefty combo by Robby. Getting the uh, the reverse backer that he wanted. Try. I wonder if Quill messed up right there with the forwarder or something. Wow, another reverse Tiger Woods. Phil Mickelson. Okay. Oh. Gets more down smash. This is looking tough for Quill. But let's see if he can pull it out. I'm surprised that back air did not get consumed by the neutral B of Robby, but what it is is what it is. Okay, tries to go for that high turner to maybe bait out a jump of Quill so that he can get another uh, hefty percentage lead. And let's see if that's going to kill it. Wow, it does. Good stuff to Robby. We're going to be waiting for.